Good evening everyone and welcome. My name is Melissa Armo and I'm here today to review LinkedIn. And the reason I'm going to review LinkedIn is because I'm going to give you a call here. Just move this. So LinkedIn had a gap down on February 5th. The earnings were catastrophic for this. If you look here the night before, this is unbelievable actually. <laughs> February 4th, the stock closed at 192.28. The, the earnings were at night actually on the following morning it opened at 125.34 that's crushing bottom line is on the day of the actual gap you see the high was 128.98 it couldn't get over 129 basically the resistance is 130 low is 102.81 this stock got pummeled pummeled on the day since the day of the gap, it broke, broke the low, actually broke $100, went to 98.25, was a low, as has rallied and tried to recover, can't do it, can't do it. This is a short, okay? So I am giving you a call here. If you want to buy puts on LinkedIn as an option trade or short the stock as a short, as a long-term short. But I'm, this actually looks like a breakdown play in the daily chart because if you look at the actual trading bars of this, it's hardly moving. One baby medium day it's had back in here. This was last week. But to be honest with you, I am waiting and waiting and waiting for one fat big red bar day. And even on Friday when the market gapped up and rallied, this stock was weak, had a red bar, and broke the low from the previous day on Thursday. So let's talk real numbers. LinkedIn, in my opinion, LinkedIn will make an all-time low this year. It will go under $60. It will go under the $55.98 number. It will break and go. It will go under $60. $60 is the normal target for LinkedIn by the end of this year, calendar year in 2016. But the dream target for LinkedIn is $30 for, for the end of 2016. So realistic target is $60. Dream target is breaking a new low in there under 55.98 and then boom, $30. I know all of you are probably thinking that's crazy because of the fact that right now it's March and the stock is trading at 115.55. But I'm telling you one of the reasons that I love to short and I short every day of the week as a day trade and I just love to short is because selling comes into stocks so hard and so fast when it comes in that something can literally lose 50% of the value out of nowhere. I mean, if you look at where the stock closed, like I, like I was saying, this is one, one earnings it had here. And look what it did. It's, it's crazy. So I'm telling you, this is lower unless it does something to fix itself, which I do not see here at all. If I see it doing something like that, I will do a video, but I don't see it. And I'm telling you every day that this stock opens and it tries to do something that tries to rally and it can't rally and it can't get anywhere and the market rallies and this stock keeps breaking. It wants to fall and it wants to fall off a cliff. So my call for LinkedIn is it's lower. Target $60. Dream target for the end of the year is $30. Can't wait to see what happens. You can buy a put, which is you're betting that the stock is lower. You can short as a swing trade. You can watch it every day to short it as a day trade. I would not buy this stock in my opinion. Good luck, everyone. Have a great weekend. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you want to learn more about shorting, which is what LinkedIn is a short. I teach a class. It's called The Golden Gap. It teaches a 26-point rating system and how to rate gaps, and that's how I know that LinkedIn is a good short. Have a great night, everyone.